Welcome to TV Repair Made Easy, brought to you by ShopJimmy.com. Visit www.shopjimmy.com to search the hundreds of thousands of TV parts in our inventory. The main board typically manages your accessory inputs and outputs and houses the TV tuner. Finding a compatible replacement mainboard for your Westinghouse TV typically requires matching both a TV, serial, or version number, and a part number. The TV serial number and version number can be found on a label on the back of your TV, while the part number can be found on a label on your board. There are six common part number patterns for Westinghouse mainboards. Part numbers beginning with 5-6 are 10 digits long. These part numbers can be found on a barcode label printed next to P slash N, which is short for part number. Part numbers beginning with 55 are 10 to 11 digits long and can be found on a barcode label. Though it is not printed on the label, this part number pattern has a decimal after the second and fifth characters. While the decimals are necessary to find part numbers within TV service manuals, searching with or without them on shopjimmy.com will yield the same search results. Part numbers beginning with 60 are 10 digits long and can be found on a barcode label. Though it is not printed on the label, this part number pattern has a decimal after the second and fifth characters. While the decimals are necessary to find part numbers within TV service manuals, searching with or without them on shopjimmy.com will yield the same search results. Part numbers beginning with 50 are 10 digits long and printed alone on a small label. Part numbers beginning with 35-D are followed by six characters. These part numbers can be found printed on a barcode label. The final part number pattern will look very similar to your LCD panel part number, but will have a space and then four more numbers printed after it. This part number can be found printed on a label on your board. Search your part number on shopjimmy.com to find a compatible replacement. Typically, your part number will match the shopjimmy item number. If searching your part number directs you to items that have slightly different part numbers, take a look at the product details to confirm that your part number is in the Substitute Parts field. As long as your part number is found in the Substitute Parts field, this item will be a compatible substitute and will work in your TV. Thank you for watching one of our many tutorials here at ShopJimmy.com. If you need any further assistance, please don't hesitate to call our award-winning customer service team at the number on your screen.